James Kaufman, World News Report today. Today is July 2nd, 2023, 7.45 p.m. Central here in the U.S. God bless you and yours, no matter where you are in the world. Please subscribe, give us a thumbs up, ring that bell for critical future updates. Ladies and gentlemen, we've just had an X1 flare. We're going to get some additional information right now. This is still a story that is developing, as you can see here, by our GOES X-ray flux. Head over to GOES Solar Ultraviolet Imager, 195 angstroms. We can see the huge X-flare coming out of 3354. It looks like a very large explosion. You can definitely bet there's a chromal mass ejection associated with this explosion. As you can see right there, basically earth facing or at least on the earth side of the disk for sure over to the d region absorption prediction center so we know it's hit goes x-ray flux and our goes satellite and now we see the x-rays have hit the earth looks like this is going to start right around 22:30 utc time maybe that was a precursor and about 23:10 maybe 2321 looks like the peak of this x flare you can see how strong the radio alternation is this was directly over hawaii again also over parts of north america including canada the united states and of course alaska is included in the united states it looks like a direct hit on hawaii you can be sure that ham radio operators and Marine operators lost radio function for around one hour period of time. We'll take this through. We have been running a C 1.5 to 3 base flare, a very long term flare. Here we are into the next day UTC time, and we can see that it's still lit up completely here 30 minutes into the day. A very large explosion indeed. And here we are looking at our solar disk. This is the latest picture that we've taken. You can see 3354 there, very complex, over 25 sunspots in the sunspot region there, 3354 AR 3354. There is a very good chance that this will be geoeffective towards Earth based on the position of that blast. You're also guaranteed that this did generate a chrome mass ejection or CME, and there's a very good chance that this will impact Earth within 48 hours or maybe even less. God bless you and yours, folks. Please share, subscribe. Always remember, anything is possible in Bizarro World.